the next problem which we have is a very important problem it says if 2a plus 3b plus 6c is equal to 0 then we need to show that a quadratic equation ax square plus bx plus c has at least one root in the given range of 0 to 1. In order to proceed with this question, we first see this expression 2a plus 3b plus 6c equals 0, which becomes a by 3 plus b by 2 plus c equals 0. First equation. Now let us consider a function fx equals ax square plus bx plus c. Now if we consider another function capital fx equals integration of fx which becomes equal to ax cube by 3 plus bx square by 2 plus cx. Now we see f of 0 is equal to 0 and f of 1 is equal to a by 3 plus b by 2 plus c which we know from the first equation is equal to 0. Now we know that by Rolle's theorem if there is a function capital fx this is a point x equals 0, there is a point x equals 1 and if the value of f of 0 is equal to f of 1, fx is a continuous function in the given range and fx is also differentiable in the given range which is 0 to 1 here and the value of f of 0 is equal to f of 1 then there exists at least 1 x equals c dash in the given range which is 0 to 1 in our case such that f dash of c dash is equal to 0. I would explain the Rolle's concept once again. If there is a function fx such that f of a is equal to f of b where a to b is the given domain, f of x is continuous in the closed interval a to b, f of x is differentiable in the open interval a to b, then there exists at least one x equals c dash in the given range of a to b such that the differentiable the differentiation of the function fx at x equal to c is equal to 0. Now we clearly see f dash of x is equal to small fx in our case. So there exists at least one point in a to b such that f dash of c is equal to 0, such that f of c is equal to 0 in 0 to 1. Hence, we have proved that ax square plus bx plus c is equal to 0 at least once in the interval 0 to 1. This question involved a very important concept which was Rolle's concept which would be very useful in the forthcoming chapters.